Once you start looking at the climate change issue, you'll quickly learn that the whole discussion is dominated by scary slogans. You probably heard most of them. We have to act now to prevent a climate catastrophe. 97% of the world's scientists agree that climate change is real, man-made, and dangerous. Storms, floods, droughts, and other extreme weather threaten our cities, our civilization, and possibly our survival. The planet is heating up faster than experts predicted. And if we don't move quickly to decarbonize the economy, our children may inherit an uninhabitable world. Carbon taxes and the Paris Climate Agreement are our best hope for saving the Earth. And on they go. Arctic ice is melting, polar bears are vanishing, the coral reefs are dying, our grandchildren won't know what snow is. But something happens when you start looking for the evidence behind these slogans. You soon learn that they just don't stand up to scrutiny. Dr. John Robson is a historian and a professional journalist who's investigated public policy issues in Canada for decades. He's used to asking the hard questions, finding the solid evidence, and separating fact from fiction. It doesn't matter how often the slogans are repeated or how loudly they're shouted. What matters is evidence, and it is telling us a different story if we're willing to listen. It's time to challenge the empty slogans with facts. The Climate Discussion Nexus takes a hard look at climate policy and the scientific claims behind it. We all want to protect the environment. One slogan I agree with is that there is no planet B. But because so many major decisions are based on misleading slogans, we're risking significant harm to the economy here in Canada and to economies around the world with policies that won't do the Earth any good. We're going to dig into the science, talk to the experts, crunch the numbers, and try to find the truth about the big questions in climate science and policy. Just be warned, there are no sacred cows here. For too long, we've been told we can't question or debate any of the usual talking points about global warming. If you don't fall into line with climate orthodoxy, you're smeared as a denier, a flatter fool, or a venal stooge of the oil industry. That's not argument, it's abuse. And that negative tone is a major reason the whole discussion's at a dead end. The country's divided, and nobody's happy with the status quo. We need argument, not character assassination. Shutting down debate has never worked as a means of getting at the truth. So let's open up the discussion for real. We're a crowdfunded initiative led by a small group of Canadians who don't work for the oil industry or any other business group. We're independent of government and not in the pocket of big environmental foundations. We're supported by ordinary Canadians who think the time has come to hear from all sides, that more information will mean better decisions, and that we need to put the discussion on a solid, fact-based footing. That's what the Climate Discussion Nexus is all about and we're inviting you to be a part of it.